Alright, here we have from the Russian playing soccer. circumstance we find ourselves in I would say so to the left here we have the, the ongoing construction of the, the Oworoshoki Ushoti Expressway Here we are in Bagada or Bagada. Story behind the name. Story for another day. <laughs> However, let's get on to checking the compliance level of churches and other religious worship centers. Road or is it Dia Street? Once upon a time, a very smooth road. Once upon a time, a very smooth road. Dia Street. At the end of it is home to is called at the, at, the tail on, at the very end of the road you can see one of Nigeria's largest churches and that usually costs a big traffic jam here and usually costs a big traffic jam on Sundays Completed sometime 2014 or 2015. And it was built to accommodate about 50,000 or so people. Worshippers got their car park on the left there. It looks close to the um, see they are observing in this area of Bagada. They are rightly observing. Clients fully. Very, very thoughtful of this church to ensure that this happened. We're driving just down this road. As 
well. Couple of couple of Bigushans are here on the road. Out and about, church to my left, Fox Square Church. Okay, some bakery stores are open. Generally, the hustle and bustle is on. Left to the road, the road on the left there. I can't see too many people heading to church. Eventually, that is what many people would do. They would head home where they do not, where the churches are not open. The Sunday market. I'm not sure that lady is getting so much patronage this morning. Now we all know. I can imagine why patronage won't be as high as it usually was every Sunday, except for those who are still looking to stock up. Majority will just sit at home and see how things turn out over the weekend. Church to the right again. Nigeria's biggest church. Considering the very limited traffic right now. tell that this place or this church did not operate today. stations are still open. upon a very nice looking street, a sweet street. Hopefully sometime soon the government will would invest some resources for this area. 